guys, welcome back to the vlog. It's Tuesday, November 30th, and I cannot believe I forgot to show you what the tree looks like. And there you have it. Blue, silver, Star Wars, a few nutcrackers, a snowflake, and baby's first Christmas ornament. That star is really, really cool. I have to show it to you at night because it's got like rainbow color changing LEDs. Oh yes, and I just put up the stockings. Yeah. So, weekend recap. My husband had the entire Thanksgiving weekend off, obviously. So we did on Friday, we got ready for Christmas. Saturday, much as I was trying to avoid it, I believe we did go shopping. As I feared, shopping over the weekend when there's lots and lots of post-Thanksgiving crowds. Ugh. Not my favorite thing to do. Sunday was church. We did a little bit more running around. Monday, my poor little boy. <laughs> He had to get his very first round of shots for his two-month appointment. <sighs> and he took it like a trooper, but the bad news is he does have a couple of problems. First of all, he's slightly behind in his motor skills. He's not really reaching out for things that much. He's sort of content to sort of sit where he is. He's a couch potato, essentially. And I need to get him more active. I need to give him more tummy time because there is something <laughs> there is something going on with his head and that is he has plagiocephaly which is a fancy name for flat head syndrome that is when a baby puts too much weight too consistently on one side of their head and their skull is still being molded so it's sort of it gets lopsided and if it goes unchecked it can lead to a couple of short circuits in the brain, so that's bad news. We have to get that corrected. Initially, uh, the plan is give him more tummy time, and when he's napping, make sure he's lying at least partially on his left side so the weight will be off his right side. If it doesn't correct by the time he's four months old, he's going to need a therapeutic helmet. Now, my youngest nephew who's with my brother and sister-in-law. He also had to wear a therapeutic helmet for like, I think it was the first year of his life. It was a long time that he had to wear a helmet. But he's doing better now. That poor kid also had a lot of other issues. And But for their privacy, I'm not gonna go into it. I'm just saying I'm familiar with the fact of babies needing a helmet to reshape their head. Don't like the idea, but if it's necessary, I'll of course do it. Uh, yeah, my pediatrician, recommended since he doesn't he is not getting enough sleep these days we're doing sleep training during nap time Ugh. do not like it it was the first day of it this morning and did not like it but it seems to work either that or he's super drowsy from the shots he got yesterday because he's on his second nap he'll probably be waking up from that any minute i did hear him fuss a couple minutes ago but I'm not sure if he was fussing to sleep or if he wants his afternoon snack. Because we, I put him down at about 12.30 and it's 2.30 now. So that would be a two hour nap, which is not bad. Definite improvement on what he has been getting. So, yeah, that's what's been going on as far as decorating and the baby's concerned. So what have I been up to today? Well, once again, it's all about getting caught up on dishes. Oh shoot, I just remembered there's a load of diapers that I need to grab out of the dryer and reassemble because he's on the uh, old-fashioned pre-folds that apparently, even with the water-resistant covers, leak like a sieve. He pees right through them. Um, I like the pocket diapers a lot better for containing leaks and messes. But there's that, and I managed to edit not just one, but two videos. One from the week before last, Ooh. 
and one from last week. Now I did not get any footage of Thanksgiving as you'll see. What I need to be focusing on is uh, getting my baby on a schedule and also taking care of myself. The pediatrician, they're also, it's not just the kids health they're worried about at that office but also the mother's health because if mom's not doing okay she can't take care of the baby and I do have postpartum depression so I haven't touched on that in detail but um, it's there and it's not fun. I've had a couple of breakdowns lately. Yesterday I was in a low spot because I thought the issues my son is having were my fault even though the doctor said they're not but I still feel guilty about it, you know what I mean? So the agenda this week is getting caught up on things that I've fallen behind on, making plans for next year's videos, maybe possibly recording a Star Wars video? I have no idea, none whatsoever. Getting the baby on a schedule and sending Christmas cards, which yes, I finally finished them except for the messages inside and the envelopes. To finish those I'm gonna have to get another glue stick unless I could find one kicking around in there somewhere and um, custom make the envelopes because they won't fit in regular envelopes and there's also pictures that I haven't even taken yet that we need to print out next weekend. No, this coming weekend. We need to take pictures, print them out, and send them off as Christmas presents to family members. So rather busy week ahead. I'm going to try and document as much as I can. I don't want to skip any more days except for Saturday and Sunday. I might start vlogging on Saturday but honestly that just makes it more of a crunch to get it out by the following Tuesday because the weekly vlogs I want to see if I can get on an actual reliable schedule put them up every Tuesday evening at 5 p.m. So there we go. And I think Okay, I haven't heard my baby since that little outburst, knock on wood. I may poke my head in there to check on him, see if he's awake or not. If he is awake, I'm going to go ahead and change him, feed him, all that good stuff. Possibly do tummy time with him. If I can do tummy time, I want to document that, see if I can help teach him to roll over. He's supposed to be rolling over, at least a little bit by now, so I want to get on that. That's what's been going on. Oh, yeah, side note, I ordered cookie cutters online over the weekend. It said it was delivered, but apparently someone made off with the package. So he had to buy the cookie cutters all over again. Good news is, once I get the baking supplies like chocolate chips and sprinkles and whatnot, I can do some Christmas baking. That's going to be next week, and I'm definitely documenting that. So, see you guys later. Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. I'm sorry I'm not doing much with it, but... Honey, honey, look, sidewalk. See you. This is right. Okay. I'm going this way. All right. Okay, cool. We are, are we are at Liberty Park in Salt Lake City, and we're here to do a light uh, light walk, uh, which is um, the uh, Christmas lights outside. And I've never done one before. So we got a little baby with us, and he is currently conked out at the moment. Yeah, it's kind of chilly out here. Not super cold. Probably yeah, but uh, we're still looking for the beginning of it. <laughs> yeah, we have no idea where we're going. <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> All right, cool. Okay, so off we go to see the lights. Yay! Oh wow. Oh boy. I mean, I take pictures, but I have a baby. So. I know. Oh boy. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. This is awesome. This is amazing. Ah! <laughs> this is so cool. Seven canyons. So Fountain. Fountain. Ooh, we're Obviously gonna have to come back here in summer. Come in the summer. Oh boy. And they got food vendors and everything out here. Wow. This is a huge event. I had no idea this was this popular. 
Sometimes I think because of my accent, I stick out a little bit. It's okay. This is so neat. Giddy now. Uh huh. Guys, if you can see her face. Oh my god. This is so cool. Wow. Guys, you this is a believe lot this. of lights. This is gorgeous. I almost want to put on my sunglasses. Wow. This is I get goosebumps and not just from the cold. If I knew how to swing it, I'd say we're not here. Okay. So, Kanan met Santa Claus. Yeah. You got a picture with him. We got video. We got picture proof. Yeah. Oh, it's a wonderful life. Definitely have to get a picture of this one. Let's go through the light maze. <laughs> He's like, I have no idea what's going on. I don't think this is a maze. I think it's just sort of the pictures of the stars. Yeah. Christmas. What? Are you running low on battery already? Jeez. Good idea. All right, let's go. Nah, gross. Hi. <laughs> light maze. Come on, another one. We're in the big boy light maze now. Yeah. Oh wow, this is literally a maze. It literally is a maze. How do we get out of here? It's amazing. <laughs> it is amazing. I love the purple. <laughs> Pretty blue, huh? Oh, where'd you go? They're all over there. In the white and pink. Yeah, no. Better. Yeah. <coughs> no more selfies. Oh, wow. These are beautiful. Yeah, they are. He's so pretty. There you go, buddy. Now you can see him. Yeah. There we go. Oh yeah, there we go. Yeah. Trip him looking at the lights. <laughs>